This is the story of someone recently moved to Trinidad and is just trying to get a driving license. It starts on day one, in a dirty and decrepit looking building that took an hour to find as there is no sign on the outside of the building. Good morning, wow that was a long queue, I need to sit the written driving test to validate my UK license over here. You foreigners should not have come today, we are too busy. I'm sorry, I checked on your website and there was nothing on there. The website is two years out of date. Oh, I see don't you think it should be updated then? That is not my responsibility, that is someone else's fault. Oh, I see well I have taken today off work so I really need to get this done. Here is my paperwork. Let me see. You have written yesterday's date on this form I cannot accept it. Okay, let me change the date for you. No you must go to the front of the building, join the queue and fill out a new form. Is there any chance I could just get one of the forms from that pile of spares that you have on your desk? That way I will not miss the written exam starting in 15 minutes. No, I told you we are very busy and you foreigners should not have come today. Okay, I give in I will try again tomorrow. It is not my responsibility, it is someone else's fault. It is now the following day. Hello, I was here yesterday I have come to sit my written test. Here is my paperwork all correctly signed and dated. You do not have the correct paperwork with you. You will not be able to sit the test today. But this is the same paperwork I had yesterday. You did not tell me there was anything missing then. It is not my responsibility to ensure that you have the right paperwork. Could I speak to your supervisor please? You will have to wait. Two hours later I finally got to speak to a supervisor, who told me that it was not a responsibility and that it was someone else's fault. I have missed the test again so I will try again tomorrow. It is now the third day. Hello I would like to sit my written driving exam. Here is my paperwork. Very well, you may now take the test. Sit at this old wooden bench and fill out this poorly worded exam paper with this broken pencil. The answers are all in any of the pamphlets that are lying around on the floor. The test will take about 5 minutes. Okay, I have finished. Now what should I do? Now you will wait 6 hours while I mark your exam and process your application. Then you will pay $535 and you will then be given a Trinidad driving license. Thank you. As a visitor to your beautiful country I would just like to say what a thoroughly pleasant experience it has been spending the last three days here in the government driving test center. I am really looking forward to driving in Trinidad which appears to have some of the worst driving habits I have seen in any of the 42 countries I have visited around the world. Goodbye. It's not my responsibility, it's someone else's fault.